Yeah, welcome to another adventure of Hosier Craft. Welcome back if you've been here before, and if you have not, welcome. Uh, today I'm doing a little bit of detail on cleaning up the headlights. You know how those plastic headlights nowadays get really foggy? Well, I was checking out some guy on uh, Stony Ridge Farmer. That's the guy. Uh, being a farmer, I watch a lot of farm videos. I've got a farm. He's got a farm. And he's got a lot of helpful tips. So he was talking about using buffing compound to clean the headlights of his neighbor's car. So I figured, okay, I'll give it a try. Well, check this out. This stuff on my truck is like, almost like frosted glass or plastic. And now uh, it's pretty clear. So uh, if you check this out and watch this video, you'll see how good it works just the first pass. I'm going to do a few more passes, I imagine, and uh, get those lights looking nice. I'm surprised it really works. Uh, normally, I don't believe a lot of stuff I see on the Internet. YouTube is a great source of information. Uh, I found a lot of ways to repair things. I've got a couple of videos about that. And uh, if you haven't uh, been to this channel before, hey, talk about what you like. Click the like button if you like it. Click the dislike button if you dislike it. But please, if you're going to dislike it, leave a comment. Why do you dislike it? What can I do better? I would always like to improve on what videos I put out. Um, so, yeah, I've got this uh, 2005 uh, Chevy Colorado here. And it's my little truck out on the farm, but it's the one that does most of the work. <laughs> Mom's got a really beautiful 2012 uh, F-150, all lifted, all shiny, all polished, got all the top-notch stuff. But uh, it's not the one that's doing the work. It could do the work, but it's a pretty truck. My truck's the work truck. And so uh, you check this out, and I've got spark plug changes, which is very different from what I used to do. Uh, I've got a uh, thermostat change. I've got a brake pad change. Uh, a lot of things on the vehicle. I've got things about my uh, zero-ton lawnmower. I've got things about my power washer, my chainsaw, everything we do on the farm, different equipment. So uh, come on out uh, if you are interested in these kind of things. If you want to learn something, I've got blacksmithing videos. Uh, click subscribe. And if you know anybody wants to, I've got a lot of do-it-yourself, home repair. I mean, when you live on a farm, you got to fix everything yourself. When you own your home, you got to fix everything yourself. So, hey, share these videos to anybody who owns a home or fixes anything if you do repairs. There is quick and easy ways to do things that used to take a lot more effort. But we got some modern stuff, which really works well. So, uh, let's check this video out. I'll show you these headlights real quick. And stay tuned, and I will see you in a few minutes. Okay, let's try a little bit of something for uh, cleaning up these lights here. Cow. Pale, that is. Really pale. Uh, yeah, it looks pretty nasty. See what we can get with that. Got this uh, ultimate compound here. It's brand. You can get it at Walmart. You can get it at uh, AutoZone. You can get it at O'Reilly's. Most auto parts stores. Let's put a little dab on a rag. Okay, let's try uh, putting a little bit of a goop on a rag here. Yeah, a little bit there. All right. Smear that around the rag. Put some of my hood. Huh? Need some attention. All right. So we'll just rub this around here. Come on, and I'm going to do the same thing here. Put a little bit more goop on there. Just about anywhere between a teaspoon and a tablespoon. Stuff's not not cheap, but it ain't really expensive either. So. Rub some of that on there. All right. Just rub it in and let it set. See what happens, huh? 
do the other side too. There I'm done with the old dishcloth. Now I'm going to rub it off with an old t-shirt. See what happens here. Oh, yeah, that looks a lot better. Might need to do it twice, but... That's uh, about 100,000 times brighter than it was before. Holy Moses, look at that. That was like you couldn't even see inside there now. Almost crystal clear. Like I said, I might have to do it twice, but this uh, first go over is like amazing. Okay, let's look at the other side here. Okay, look at how crusty and deformed that is. Okay, let's take and wipe that stuff off now. Let's see what we get. Holy Moses! That is amazing. That's one wipe. Now I imagine I have to do it two or three times to get it perfect, but holy Moses, just the just that one Passover made a 300% difference. Okay, what is this stuff? Uh, Ultimate Compound Color and Clarity Restorer. And it's mostly like for paint or something, but uh, I saw some guy using it to clean the headlights. You know, they got like all these millions of things for cleaning your headlights. This stuff apparently works. Uh, take a look at your before and after for yourself. Rewind it and look at it. Yep. Hit that a couple more times and I think that will be very good. All right. That's going over it the second time. And uh, it's like 100% more clear. Now, I probably need to do a little bit to get on the inside, but I'm not going to take my headlight out to do the inside. But the outside is perfect. Uh, so, yeah, that's buffing compound really does work. Um, it also, just for note, I had, uh, if you guys all have a problem with bird poop, I had bird poop on my windows, and I just power washed it. I wiped it. I scrubbed it. Finally, I took a green pad, and the green pad scratched my glass. And, uh, you know, I mean, I use green pads, green scratch pads. A lot of things are not supposed to scratch, but I guess glass is now a compound of plastic and glass. Well, I put this stuff on and got rid of my scratches. On the other side, I still have some, but that's passenger side. I'm not worried about the driver's side. The scratches are gone. And all I did was uh, rub some of this on, wait a couple of minutes, and buff it off with a dry rag. My rag was a cotton t-shirt so uh, clean your headlights your tail lights your windshields get rid of scratches buff up the china car get some buffing compound a little expensive but a lot cheaper than replacing your windshield or your headlights and that's all for hosier craft if you haven't yet click like if you want to dislike tell me why leave a comment and uh if you have not yet, punch that subscribe button. And anybody wants to know information about farming, blacksmithing, do-it-yourself, auto repair, any of that stuff, go ahead and share, share, share. And uh, if it's your first time here, welcome. If you've been here before, good to see you again. And I hope to see you again and again and again. So click that subscribe button, ring that bell, and you'll know when I make new videos. So uh, until next time, God bless you. And see you next time.